everybody, I'm over here with Beacon at CHA, right now Creative Vision 2017, and we're gonna make a cute little clip like you see right here. So let me show you how to do it. First, all I did is I took a cardboard square, like you see here, and I pulled off the front, because this actually came from a famous Amos box that my friend gave me, Betsy, she's the one filming it. And I'm going to take a little bit of, and what I did is I took the Fast Finish Decoupage, and I took just a little bit of glitter, and this just happens to be some ultra fine premium glitter. And I mixed it right here with a paintbrush, and that becomes our decoupage. You're gonna take it and just kind of lightly brush a little bit on just to get it a little bit wet. And then I took a whole bunch of Canvas Core and Seven Gypsies papers, and we're gonna cover the front with that, just lay it on top, and then take a little more just to seal it in. And it gives you that lovely little glitter, but you still have that really pretty tissue paper look on there. And you can do one of two things. You could fold it over and do that, just kind of rub it down. Or you can actually trim the rest of your tissue off. Really doesn't matter, both work. You could rip it too. It's such fine, you know, it, it's a very distressed look. So you could rip it if you wanted to, just like I'm showing you right there. It works just as well. Whatever flights your fancy there. I'm gonna tuck it in if you feel like you need a little bit more. Just to kind of set it down. There we go. And I love the cardboard behind there for two reasons. One, it kind of gives a cool background effect behind everything, and two, everybody has cardboard. So it's really easy. I'm just gonna heat so this super quick. It really doesn't taste long, hence the point fast finish. And now we have a full bunch of really fun little things. And a lady just came by and made a really cute project where she took some of these flowers that we've ripped apart and we glued one down. So right now I'm just using Beacon 3-in-1 glue, as you see right here. Just adding a little bit, gluing down a flower, just like that. And then we have a new product called Druzy. And what it is, is it is a glue, and then you put these really cool crystals on top. We took a little plastic circle, and we kind of added a little bit of this new Druzy color, which is this crystal plastic paste. It's kind of like a glue. Put that on, and then we put uh, our silver crystals on top of that and let it dry. So now we have these really pretty DIY little crystal dots. It's gorgeous. Put it right there in the center for the center of our, our flower. Put that there in the middle. You know, and I love mixing gold with silver and silver with gold. I'm not picky about one way or the other. And then I have some little backings. There's little pin backings. And I'm just gonna put a little glue on the back of this and put our pin on the back. And you have a very cute little DIY pin. Awesome. You could also put a magnet on the back if you would want to and then it becomes a fridge magnet. So it's really super easy. So thanks so much for stopping by and I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.